our electronic journal. Once we select electronic journal, we can select it by date or all. So I'm going to hit enter for date and we're going to use today's date, the end time, 24 hour sequence. And this is our electronic journal. We can scroll through it and look at all our transactions for today. Or we can print it. And every transaction that has been entered for today will be printed out. And if there's a lot of transaction, then this list will be quite long. Right now we're just demonstrating. So we don't have that much transaction in here to be reprinted. So you can go back a few days and select the date, just a sequence of entering the date, which is month, the day, and year. We don't have anything on those dates, so we got an, an error. But once you do, it will bring up that electronic journal for that date and we could be printed. Now keep in mind, electronic journal has to be cleared every so often. Um, once it get full and that can be verified by hitting the quantity button which shows you how many space is available for the electronic journal once that number gets down to 2030 we know that electronic journal has to be cleared go back again to reports now we go into Z reports um, the Z reports will re reset the machine total to zero for next day so the daily Z report should be run it doesn't give you an option to um, display the Z report it will just print once the Z report is printed it will clear the system sales for next day so this should be run every night and it gives you your department total for the day the cash and drawer your tax amount for today there's also the purely report same as before the clerk report the hourly report the periodic Z2 report, um, I recommend running that um, once a week, preferably every Sunday or the last day of the week. Or if it's a slow business, you may run it every two weeks or in a, or every month. So you get a sales for that week or sale, complete sales for that two weeks or complete sales for that month, depending on, I guess, um, if you want to get your tax or VAT record for that week. You can use the periodic Z2 report for that. Um, under the Z report, you have that option to clear the journal. Once you clear the journal, um, it will erase the journal and you'll start from zero. So keep in mind, you may want to print your journals off. I guess regularly so that um, you have a copy you have your own copy of each transactions you made for that day on record we hit escape to clear the batch report that's normally for credit card machine um, that doesn't apply to this machine because there's no attached credit card machine um, not to worry about the EFT report also um, that's a feature uh, we probably won't be using. Um, that's it for our reporting option.